Is on to be me. Oh, Nana. Yes, I'm here now. I'm going to be a little Um, let me adopt the protocol that has been established. However, I want to welcome every one of us to this very special event. I consider this very special because it's a marriage ceremony. The a marriage between Rebecca and Lucky. I've known Luck, I mean I've known Rebecca while she was much younger. I do not quite know Lucky. But I've known Rebecca's father forever. He has been a friend and the elder brother of a friend. His contributions to the development of the joint nation cannot be overemphasized. And so when he said I should be for this event, I felt I should drop everything and be here. I believe that most of us are here for similar reasons. Because it's a marriage, I believe that in heaven there is jubilation now. Because when you find a wife, they say you found something nice, a good thing. So since uh, those in heaven are jubilating, we should also jubilate here. So let us know that we are here for merriment. We are here to uh, join two young persons together to start a family. We are here to join two families together. We are here to join two uh, communities together. So let us jubilate and put that as the back of our minds. I heard someone talking about CSU and protection and so on and so forth. I believe everyone is protected by God in this event. Don't be afraid. <laughs> Whatever you are offered, please enjoy it. Uh, having said that, I will simply just, uh, because I'm not seeing the couple, I can't quite advise, but <laughs> if they can hear me, I just want to add that uh, marriage is usually joining of two persons that are strange. Usually are not of the same family. So two strangers are joined together and they're expected to live in harmony together forever. No separation, no divorce. So you have been joined together. But the fact is that because you are two strangers, you are not expected to also have what is called a complete smooth sail. If you are used to uh, a bit of engineering, there is an engine they call the piston. The piston engine. Even the generators, you are hearing it, the sound is not smooth. The sound is not smooth because it is doing up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. But it's that up and down that is making me to speak so clearly using that generator. It is the up and down that produce children. It is the up and down that produce a strong marriage. So, ups and downs are normal in a marriage. You shouldn't run away because your marriage is seeming to go up or down. It is never constant. It's not going to be up forever. It's not going to be down forever. But in going up and down, it is generating energy. And that energy can be in the form of a child, and another child, and a set of twins, and money, and wealth, and everything. And then 25 years later, you have Silver Jubilee, and 50 years later, you have Golden Jubilee of this marriage that we have started today. This is the advice for the couple, and for those who are not married yet, if you are afraid of marriage, you don't need to be afraid. Marriages are usually like that. Even if they don't look very wonderful in the beginning, once you are committed to the marriage, after a few years it becomes a marriage of note. So that is the note on which I am going to declare this marriage open and let us continue the celebration. Marked by Gwerifa. Yeah.